A local program is keeping kids off the streets by introducing them to basketball. Rich Walsh explains how it works and how it's helping the community. There's been a lot of great Pittsburgh basketball players over the years. Some are playing in March Madness right now. And whether we're talking recently or years ago, they've all walked through these doors here at Ammon Rec Center in the Hill District. Former Pitt basketball star Darrell Porter was one of those players walking through those doors years ago, and this place made such an impact on him. Now he's opening the doors for the next generation of stars. If you don't want to get charges, you got to work on your jump stuff. If you're a basketball fan, you heard of Ozenamp. It's where local legends honed their skills on the court. Its summer league in the Hill District is known around the country, attracted all the big names. But Ozenam isn't just for the athletically gifted. It's a place where kids can call home. Their mission is to make a difference in the lives of the youth. We have so many kids who start in our program, and then once they grow out, they're still here. <laughs> and so sometimes I have kids 18, 21 still working out because it's like that's what they grew up doing. Chuck Cooper Field House. What you going to tell me about Chuck Cooper? Hall of Famer. First African-American draft NBA. All right, we got our brain on. Now we're getting ready to work. Porter offers his time and knowledge every day after school so kids take the right path. The more kids that we keep busy in here, the less trouble they can get in. And then we run them enough where they're tired when they leave here and they go to bed. And his focus isn't necessarily on the best basketball players. The kids that I really uh, dig into are the kids who probably aren't as good in athletics because this is a, a chance for us to change their life. And if they get the right skills and take the right approach, then they can be successful. OZ on three. One, two, three. Get a ball. In the Hill District, Rich Walsh, KDK News.